and welcome to The Fix. And today I'm going to change the battery on this E220 diesel 2016 model. So let's get started. First of all, we've got to undo these two clips here and then slide this panel out. Underneath the panel it's got two clips that slide under there. So remember not to yank it off, just slide it out forwards. And here's the um, cabin filter, or the pollen filter cover. So for this, you just push that back, that tab there, like that. And same on the other side. And then you lift this upwards so it clips over them clips. Okay, if we just put that to one side. And now here's the battery. If I just take this cover off, undo that bolt down there you could see you could either use a torque or a 13 mil socket to undo that so let's undo that first okay I've got that down there my hand down there. Okay that seems to be loose now so now I'm going to get the 13 I mean a 10 mil spanner and undo the positive terminal I mean the neg negative terminal. Undo the negative terminal first so if you hit the body or something you won't spark out. Now the negative terminal's off we're going to undo the positive one so this way it doesn't matter if your spanner is touching the positive terminal when it hits a part of the body, it won't spark out. So that's the way to do it. When you're taking off the battery, take off the negative terminal first and then the positive. That's out. Now hopefully we should be able to pull this battery out if that clamp's moved over. Yep. Get to take the terminal off again. It's a bit tight in there. Try and move this out of the way. Okay. That's it, that's one battery out of the car. So now we've taken the battery out, we've got a lot of leaves in there, so I'm just going to hoover that out, the leaves from it. Right. Now we've cleaned it all out, hoovered it out, so it's nice and clean in there. Let's put the battery in. Okay, now I'm going to put this battery in. It's a bit heavy, so... Put this in there like that. And at the same time... Pull this terminal out. And now we've got to get it into the bracket. Okay. okay. Slide it in like that to the back. move that 
over towards us this I've got to move this a bit back huh, with a screwdriver or something yeah I'm gonna have to take that bracket off completely so I'm gonna undo that 13 mil bolt right got the bolt out you can see there now that the bolt holds gone to a different angle so I'll just put that straight that down there put the bolt back in see now we've got the bolt back in and the bracket on top of the ledge of the battery so that's ready to tighten down now secured now the bracket so now we're going to put the terminals on. Oh, when putting the battery back we go in the reverse order. This time we're going to put the uh, positive terminal, the plus terminal on first. And that's the reason for that is because, say like I'm, gonna, I'm tightening it up now from here. And if I touch like the body of the car, the metal, it won't spark out and it won't do any damage to any of the components. So. When you're putting the battery back on, always put the positive terminal on first. And then after that, we put the negative one on. Because when you're tightening up the negative terminal, it doesn't matter if you touch it to earth or anything, because it won't do no damage. Alright, that's our battery fitted now. We'll just put all the stuff back together again. I'll just put this cover on. That's back on as well. Now we've got the battery back in there, I'm going to put this pollen filter cover back in. If you see in there, there's the tags, and you just push it down onto them tags, like that, make sure it's on all the way along, and then this just clips in there, back again, that's done. Right now we're going to put back the, this panel, remember, yeah, this, as you can see I said it had two clips, but it's got three, I didn't see that one, so these just slot under there, and It. that's pushed all the way back in and then you just put this on there it's not quite in, oh that's it that's in position now and then you just turn these two little clips and lock them in place and that's it done right now that we fitted the battery on this e220 and if you haven't already subscribed please subscribe to the channel and also click the click the bell icon so you could get all my future videos of the fix thank you